the reality is, is that we're still right smack dab in the middle of, of this opioid epidemic. And as it continues, communities are looking at different ways to keep people safe. There is a significant um, need for this in just in terms of sort of properly disposing sharps in our community, right? I mean, it is just, um, it's been an ongoing issue. There are already syringe exchange programs in the community that hand out sterile needles and collect used ones. But now there are two new boxes for disposal in high need areas. For the last year, community organizations around Dover have worked together to make syringe disposal boxes more accessible. The goal is that by having boxes that can be accessed 24 seven anonymously, the needles and other medical waste will find their way into the boxes and not be tossed on the ground in public spaces. There is evidence that shows that given these resources, the amount of waste found in the vicinity of those disposal resources goes down. The locations were selected carefully using the organizations that have similar programs in the Dover Police Department to identify places that are already seeing needles. It's meant to blend in a little bit more and, you know, not call attention to what it is. If you scan this QR code on the side of the disposal box, it will bring you a list of resources available in the community. In Dover, Kelly O'Brien, WMUR News 9.